Hey heroes, hope you're all having an amazing day. I'm Roy Kayin, thank you so much as always for taking the time to check out my channel and check out this video. I hope you enjoy. And guys, I present to you the final Pokemon set of the year, Fusion Strike. Alrighty guys, as you can see on camera, we have the a brand new Pokemon TCG set, Fusion Strike. Apologies, I know this came out a week ago, but as I explained in my previous video, I wasn't guaranteed shipping for that day, so I did have to wait a week. But guys, it is finally here. I am so, so excited to open this up. As I said, it is the last Pokemon TCG set coming out in English this year. Uh, and it is also one of the biggest Pokemon TCG sets in history. So I'm hoping we can get some good pulls today. But guys, for those of you that don't know, here is a, a very quick overview of the uh, brand new Fusion Strike set. Alrighty guys, so Fusion Strike is the brand new Pokemon TCG set which was released on November 12th. It revolves around the legendary Pokemon Mew. It is the 8th main expansion of cards from the Sword and Shield series. Fusion Strike also introduces the Fusion Strike style mechanic to Pokemon TCG. It is the biggest Pokemon TCG set with 284 cards in the set and it is the final English Pokemon TCG set of the year. Alrighty guys, as I mentioned, I'm so excited to be opening up the final Pokemon TCG set of the year. If you guys are as excited as I am, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. Let's do this guys, let's open it up. Alrighty guys, so firstly, as you can see, we have the Pokemon TCG Players Guide, which comes with every Elite Training Box. And as you can see behind, we have the actual Fusion Strike box, which looks absolutely incredible. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up very carefully. All right, guys, as you can see on camera, we have the two counters, which come with every Pokemon Elite Trainer box. We also have these very funky looking dice. I like the uh, blue one up top there, looks very cool. We also have our energy cards, again, which come with every Elite Trainer box. We probably have hundreds, if not thousands of these now. Uh, guys, we also have the Pokemon TCG Game Rules booklet right there. And guys, we also have these very cool looking uh, card sleeves right there with the Mew on it, of course. And very similar to the card sleeves, we also have the four deck dividers. Again, absolutely love the new artwork for this set. We have your very first code card of the day. As I do in all my videos, I give those out. So make sure you stick around for a few more. And guys, we also have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight packs of Pokemon Fusion Strike. And yes, I just love to show off my counting skills every now and then. All right, guys, before we go ahead and open this up, you already know what time it is. It is, of course, time for Lucky's Last Pack Magic. As you can see, I have put a cat treat on every single booster pack today just to make things easier. So the first pack that Lucky goes towards, we are going to pick for our last pack magic, although he has already started eating the treat. So there we go. And guys, hang on. I think he just popped his paw on the Genesect right here. All right, so I'm gonna give him the treat. Lucky, you want your treat? Right, sit, paw, where's the paw? Paw, paw. Lucky, you're embarrassing me on camera. Paw, Lucky, paw. I'll just have the treat. All right, there we go, guys. And I believe we have a winner with the Genesect Fusion Strike Boost Pack right here. And as always, thank you very much for your help, buddy. And as you can see from Lucky's last pack magic, he has chosen the Genesect pack. So we are going to hold that off for now. We're gonna hope for some last pack magic with that one. So I'm gonna keep that to the side and we are going to go ahead and open up some Fusion Strike, guys. All right, guys, I have gone ahead, shuffled the packs and I've cut the tops off just to make life a little bit easier. And we are starting with that incredible looking Gengar artwork pack. So I'm gonna go ahead, get your very first code card of the day for you. 
and I haven't actually had a look at the card set list for Fusion Strike yet as it's the last set of the year I kind of wanted it to be more of a surprise this time around so I have absolutely no idea what cards are in this set uh, although I do know uh, there is your second pro card I do know there are some very awesome looking new cards in here of course uh, Fusion Strike revolves around Mew uh, and guys we are going to go ahead and start with our very first pack so as far as I know it should still be the four card trick uh, but we're going to test this out with the very first pack here and guys here we go with our first ever Fusion Strike booster pack let's go all right, we are starting with a darkness energy. I kind of completely forgot about the energy guessing game. Uh, we've been opening celebration for so long and I'm so used to opening these celebrations packs, of course. Uh, so we've got the darkness energy right there. Going into a Galarian Berserker, uh, which I must say looks very cool. Um, usually not one of the coolest Pokemon, but I like what they've done with the artwork there. We have a, a Fusion Strike energy, assuming this is a brand new energy card, uh, specifically for the Fusion Strike set. We have Elisa Sparkle. We have Pantage. Uh, kind of love the artwork on the, a lot of the cards already. We've got a, a Wooloo. Woo -woo. We have a Pancham. Feels really weird opening like a normal pack of booster cards after opening celebrations for so long uh, because by now we would have finished opening the packs because they come with uh, four cards in the celebration set. Uh, we've got a Galarian Adari Marker. Indeedy. A reverse hollow pangaroo uh, that looks very cool and guys our very last card of our very first pack of fusion strike I had to think about that for a minute is a regular rare gramble all right guys I'm not gonna lie I have heard a lot of uh, semi negative reviews about fusion strike and the uh, and the pull rates from this because it is such a big set um, it, it makes it more difficult to pull some of the better cards but guys we're only in our first pack so let's hope for some uh, second pack magic alrighty guys moving on to the second pack with that very cool looking Genesect artwork and there is your second code card of the day we're going to do the four card trick and you know what I'm gonna guess a electric type energy here all right, I was not close there. We have a steel type energy going into our second pack of the day. We have Elisa Sparkle, a Dreadnought, uh, Sligu. I must say, it feels um, it feels like it's been a while since we've opened like a normal pack of booster cards, uh, aside from the short videos, of course. Um, we've got a Pampor, an Eevee. Always nice to see an Eevee. We've got a Shinx, uh, probably the happiest looking Shinx I've seen in a while. We have a Shelmet. Our reverse hollow is a Meltan. Very cool artwork there. Guys, our final card on the second pack is a Pikachu a V card right there, guys. That looks absolutely awesome. Uh, I mean, look at the fun they're coming off of him as well. That looks absolutely epic. Alrighty, guys, moving on to the third pack of the day with that very haunting looking Gangar artwork on it. Code cards. And I am going to guess a Psychic Energy for this one. I don't know why, just kind of feeling like it might be. And apparently I was completely wrong because there is a Fire Energy, guys, but that could be a good sign of things to come. So here we go, the third pack of the day. We have Shauna, we've got a Victini, uh, which looks kind of epic. We have an Electric. Pretty sure that's how you pronounce it, but let me know if I've just completely butchered that name. Uh, we've got a Jilba, a Bunnelby, some very happy Pokemon in the set, guys. We've got a Mudkip, a Caterpie. Oh, and there's another Caterpie in the background there. Very cool. Uh, we've got a Morpico. Again, sort of electrifyingly good artwork there. We have a Reverse Hollow Dragapult, uh, which looks really cool. And guys, our final card for the third pack yes that's right our final card for the third pack of the day is a regular rare Aselgo. is that how you say it i don't know all right guys we are officially halfway through the pack opening and look how cool that new artwork looks on the uh, pack right there Co cards i am going to go ahead and guess psychic energy again because uh i don't know you know it's a new artwork pack so maybe maybe yes it is a psychic energy our first correct energy guess of the day 
This could be a good sign, guys. This could be a very good sign. We have an extra drill, a, a double. Uh, spongy gloves. I, I don't know what the obsession with gloves is in, in the recent Pokemon TCG sets. If anyone knows, let me know why there are so many gloves. Uh, we got a, a Muna, a Meowth. We've got a Marrow, very cute looking Marrow. We have a Helioptile. Uh, that's some very funky artwork there. It looks very different to the uh, other artwork. Uh, we've got a Wulu, a Reverse Hollow Clobopus, and our final card is a Rainbow Rare Shauna card, guys. Are you kidding me? I cannot remember the last time we pulled a Rainbow Rare, guys. That is absolutely incredible so there we go guys rainbow rare shauna right there Alrighty, guys moving on to the fifth pack of the day can we top the rainbow rare it's probably going to be very difficult to do so but we'll see and can we just take a moment to appreciate that bolton artwork i mean oh man bolton is just one of my favorite pokemon card and i am feeling like it might be an electric type energy can we get two energy guesses right today guys here we go no we cannot but there we go guys we have a water energy i mean i'll be completely honest i'm still in shock that we pulled a rainbow rare uh I, i've been hearing such bad things about the uh, fusion strike set and how difficult the pull rates are uh but maybe luck is on our side today guys so we have a, a phalanx a semi sage uh, we've got another helioptile a, a wooloo got a gossy fleur haven't seen that one in a while we have a, a mudkip sand shrew uh again there's a there's a lot of different types of artwork in this set it's very interesting uh oh we got a reverse gudra which looks a very cool guys our final card is a regular rare luxury so the hits on these packs are kind of you know very mixed cocards and i'm feeling you know i'm gonna stick to my guns here i'm gonna say electric energy again i just have a feeling and that feeling was wrong uh it is a darkness energy uh going into a barrow scooter they really like to try and throw us off with these pokemon names don't they very difficult to say here we go a copper raja let me know if i'm saying any of these um not correctly i was trying to think of a word there uh, at least we've got an easy one here cook uh we've got a, a drilba a shinx uh a baneri a, a basculin got a grubbin a reverse makuhita uh, which is very cool and it does have the single strike logo up there guys our final card is a Serena V card. Okay, we are not doing too badly with this opening. We've got two V cards and a Rainbow Rare so far. Uh, and that looks absolutely a beautiful cook card. And as we are on our second last pack of the day, I'm going to guess a Steel Energy. No, wait, wait, wait. Fighting type energy. That's the one. Guys, would you look at that? You cannot make that up. We've got a fist bump energy right there and our second correct energy guess of the day and as we are on our second to last pack of the day i'm going to throw out the question of the day uh which is your favorite artwork of the fusion strike packs so i believe there's uh bolton gangar um there is genesect and you i'll throw them all up on screen here uh let me know which one's your favorite probably going to be a fan favorite uh my favorite is the mew artwork pack it just looks awesome because mew is like one of the best legendary pokemon ever uh we've got a semi seer going into a, a farewell bell that's that's quite the rhyming words there uh we've got a gossy fleur a mudkip going into a sand shrew a kufant uh is that the reverse no i don't think so we've got an impedim a little bit of a tricky name to say there uh we have a reverse galarian corsola guys our final card is a oh okay i um i think i have seen this being pulled on other channels so i believe this is the first pokemon card to have the fusion single and rapid strike logos all three of them uh on there obviously the oxys had different forms and um, so that's a very cool card to pull Alrighty guys, it all comes down to this, the final Fusion Strike Pack of the day, which our cat Lucky has 
hopefully blessed with some of his last pack magic. I'll be completely honest, I was not expecting as many of the good pulls that we have gotten today, uh, so I'm more than happy. But guys, here's hoping we can get some of that last pack magic. And your final code card of the day is on screen for you there. And as it is the final pack of the day, I feel like I'm going to have to guess the fire energy. It probably won't be, but we have to guess it, guys. And there is the electric energy I have repeatedly guessed throughout the opening. We finally got it. And here we go in the final pack, guys. So we have a, a dance boss, a dancer, got a pangaro, Eevee, always happy to see Eevee. We have a, a Shelda, a Voltorb, again with that very funky artwork. We have a Pan Sage, a Pufant. Our uh, Reverse Hollow is a Toxel, a Baby Toxel, very nice. Guys, our final card of the day is... No way. <laughs> Are you serious? Guys, I haven't looked at the set list but I'm like 80% sure that is an alternate art. I am, I am literally speechless right now. I think this is the first ever alternate art card I have pulled, uh, like ever, on and off the channel. Oh my God, I'm literally, oh man, I am, I genuinely don't know what to say right now. What an incredible last pack to open. Um, Guy, I, I'm literally speechless. I am so happy right now. This is ridiculous. Uh, all right, I'm, I'm gonna cut it right here because this will just be me babbling on in emotion for like an hour. So guys, we, we, we're gonna cut it right here and we're gonna go through the recap right now because this was just absolutely incredible. Alrighty guys, it is time for Ryan's recap of the day and it could potentially be the best recap I have ever had on the channel. So guys, starting with the Deoxys pool, we got a few packs ago, um, again with the Fusion single and Rapid Strike logo on it. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe that is the first time any Pokemon card has had all three logos on it. So that is a very awesome. We also pulled the Pikachu V card, uh, one of my favorite V cards that I've seen in a while actually, so that was a very cool. Uh, we pulled another V card, we pulled the Serena V card, again, uh, man the V cards in the set are awesome. Guys hold your horses there because we also pulled our very first Rainbow Rare in, in quite a while to be honest, I think the last one we pulled was Cheryl if, if I'm remembering correctly, but guys we have a, a Rainbow Rare full art Sean right there. But guys, it gets even better than that. We pulled our first ever alternate art card on the channel. Now correct me if I'm wrong, uh, because I will feel very silly if I'm wrong and this isn't actually an alt art card, uh, but just judging by the artwork, uh, I believe it is. Uh, and if it is, I am just, I am beyond happy. I, uh, I have not had an opening like this on the channel like ever before. Uh, I mean, not only do we pull Rainbow Row, we get an alt art. So yeah, guys, that was just ridiculous. So I know, I know there have been a lot of bad reviews about Fusion Strike so far. Um, maybe I'm one of the very lucky few that have had a um, an opening like this. So there we go, guys. Alrighty guys, before we go ahead and end the video, I am announcing a brand new giveaway for the Fusion Strike set. All you have to do to enter the giveaway is leave a like on this video, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, and leave a comment down in the comment section below. I will be ending the giveaway on Thursday the 25th of November, and the giveaway a winner will be announced on the 26th of November. The giveaway prize will be a free pack blister for the brand new Fusion Strike set and I'll be ordering online and shipping directly to the giveaway winner. So good luck to each and every one of you that takes time to check out the video and end the giveaway. I wish you all the best of luck. Alrighty guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video there. Again, a, a big, big thank you to each and every one of you that takes time to check out my channel and check out my videos. It means the absolute world to me. Guys, I hope you enjoyed our very first Fusion Strike opening. I hope it was worth the wait. Apologies, I know there was a week's delay, um, but I feel like it was worth it with the uh, Rainbow Rare and the Alt Art. 
Uh, again, I'm just beyond happy right now. I, I still, I'm still in disbelief, to be honest. So guys, I'm going to cut the video there before I start babbling on in disbelief for like an hour. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you have an amazing weekend and I will see you again next week.